This is how I break down my year. Mm-hmm. Postseason scouting. You're getting all that information, years past historical data. You're going to run your cameras in the summer. You're going to see what kind of quality of bucks you have. Your cameras are going to transition to your fall. You're going to get your bucks hard horn out. You're going to start putting a game plan together. You utilize that off your postseason scouting. Now your in-season scouting comes into play. All those puzzle pieces come together, your postseason, your trail camera data, your in-season scouting, you know where to be. Now you go in there and put your time in and kill. You know, that's how yeah. you that's 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 the key to it. That's what you gotta do. And you can be too mobile where if you don't have the confidence in your postseason, your trail cam data, your in season scouting, you're gonna get yourself in trouble. Um, especially in the big woods mountains, I'm a big believer. Farm country, you can get away with it a little bit more because it's, it's more, it, you're, you're, there's more deer there in general. You know yeah. what I mean? More target-rich environment. But I noticed in the Big Woods Mountains, you start chasing around, bouncing around, not saying you're not going to kill, um, but even hunting hot sign, you start doing it every day. You, you can start chasing your tail a little bit and, and not not fill your tag. 